Hello, everybody. Um, if you haven't guessed already, um, I'm going to be talking about Wrath Wings in this video. Again, my name is Tall and Skinny. Please like, subscribe, and comment to my channel if you like my videos. Um, if you are a new viewer, then sit back, enjoy the video, and all the information that I have to give you. So, let's get started. Um, in order to reach to your, in order to reach your wrath wings at the bottom right hand corner, there's a circle, and you will go to the little wrath wing that looks like a uh, a pilot's emblem almost. It's right next to the paw print on the bottom row. Um, in here, um, you can choose your wrath wings that you want to um, either level up or see what the stats are. Um, at the left, you can scroll down. You can just click on whichever one that you want. For this video, I'm just going to choose uh, my Elijah Swings. Um, as you can see in the Info tab on the right, you can see Talent. Um, some of them don't have talents. Like Shiva, it doesn't have a talent. Elijah does. Um, and then it'll tell you what is activated by green and what on the next level will be activated in red um, if you scroll down there's details how much hp attack elemental um, and so on is added to my stats um, and then combinations combinations are a great way of getting bonus um, br just by leveling up your wings and collecting all of them and it's just like my pet video you know you start with one wing and then you try and get the bonus wings that it it requests and then when you go to that bonus wing um you get that you know and so on um so that way you can get the bonuses because the bonuses are where all the most of the br is from so once you level them up to um, once you want to level them up, you go to the level tab. They cost Raging Souls. Raging Souls are available here in these different places, and they're also available in other spots. Um, if you look at my videos, there's a lot of areas that um, you can get Raging Souls, but most of the time you get them from Plunder, Deathmatch, um, Guild Wars, Resource, resource um, Wrath Chest, and then you can also get them from Honor. And you can get them from um, the Minefield, as my other video showed. You can get them from the Sky, Sky Realm, Sky Bosses. And basically, they're um, pretty easy to get. Now, if you go, if you notice that after you level up five times, um, it gives you different stats, bonuses, and every time that you level up, it increases the stats. And you can see the stats and details on info. Now, let's go to augment. Um, in order to augment, you have to collect the fragments. Some fragments are events only. Some of them are from killing world bosses. Some of them are from the sky boss. Some of them are from this event right here. Shadow Realm, Light Realm. And then you can get... It's just random. Um, it's not guaranteed, but they are available, as you can see. Um... And it gives you high quality Wrathwing fragments. So the Shadow Realm is a place to go. Um, also, I'd like to point out that there is a recharging event that I did. For only $7, you can get Arcania Wings. And so mine are rank 4. And when I get some more, I'm just going to do Ascension. Um, I will be doing a video on Just Ascension and Wrathwing Amplify and Glyphs. So if you are trying to only see that, then go ahead and 
change the video. Otherwise, um, if you guys don't know about this stuff, then stay on this one. So, um, when you augment, it increases the stats in this panel by 100% for each star. So basically, if I was to get 120 Elijah's fragments, it would increase my stats by 100%. So that would be 240 HP and etc. Um, also, not to mention that you can get, um, you can, in this page, you can get to all of the different panels within wrath wings so you can go to the wrath chest and get you know wrath wings if you're lucky um or you can get honor points whatever else that comes out of there um if you want to know what comes here there's a treasure preview and it shows you um for diamonds and for gold so there you have it for that um Wrathwing Amplify you can click on from here and in here I'll show you what to do here in another video You can go to preview and you can see what your Wrathwings will look like. So if you feel like um, The picture in here doesn't really show that very well because it doesn't have your character then you can come to preview click on them and instead of you know, choosing equip, which is down at the bottom. You can equip them and then exit and then trying to see what they look like on your character. And here, there's a preview vid preview um, menu, which is a lot more convenient. Um, you can also reach glyphs. Glyphs I'll be doing in, in the, I'll be explaining in the other video. But this is a great way to get BR, and most of the time glyphs are free um, from the resource dungeon um, under the Wrathwing. And in here, this changes per day. Each day is different. Um, as you can see, those are the... Um, it shows what days that they are available down at the bottom, and it shows what items are available and if you have vip3 or higher then you get two attempts instead of just one so that's a bonus as to why you should pay some money to the game and also donate because um you know they're spending a lot of money to keep the servers up so if you go to um back to the Wrathwing page, you can also get to ascension ascension gives a massive amount of br and also it it gives you um, many different things to your um, ultimate skill. So as you can see, um, when I unlocked uh, rank 22, when Wrathwing activation, I get a Demon Conqueror or player plus 10% dodge. So um, let me explain that in a, for a second. Basically, my skill right there with the, the orange around it down at the bottom, um, when I activate that, it'll give me Demon Conqueror Aura. Now it's flaming, as you can see. It's on fire. So when I use that, see all those buffs that just pop up? There's invincibility, all kinds of stuff. Um, that's from my Wrathwing Ascension only. Um, and then it actually gives me other things, but those are hidden. Um, they don't show you because, um, it's just showing you on the screen, the bonuses from Ascension. Um, it does give me some attack and stuff like that because that's just what the skill does. But other than that, um, everything else is from Ascension. The invincibility, the increased crit. Um, when I get my Ascension to rank 22, it'll give me dodge. Um, so I believe that com if you go to um, Selector up at the top. I'm sorry, I'm not going to finish this video yet. Um, on the top left, there's Selector. In here, you can see all of your... 
um, all of the available Wrath Wings, all of your activated and all of the uh, locked Wrath Wings. Um, so that's pretty cool. That's convenient. So if you want to level up a certain one, you just come here instead of scrolling through all of them here. Um, cause the names on here are kind of hard to see, but in here they're perfectly, um, visible. And then you can go to info and read something about it, read a story. And then up at the top, you see wrath wings. This is your total wrath wing level. Um, every time that you activate a wrath wing, it'll increase your BR and then you can upgrade your wrath wings. Currently, mine are at 1513, and this is what the bonus is that it gives me um, just for activating Wrath Wings and um, leveling them up, as well as um, combinations will increase your Wrath Wing um, Wing Sprite experience, and then you can upgrade this. So, this is um, extra BR just for doing things in this panel um so that's kind of helpful and this is why it this is the most um this that sorry a uh, <laughs> little bit late um this is why wrath wings give you the most br out of the game is because of all of the available um things that you can do so if you like this video, um, like, comment, subscribe. I'll be making a video about um, Wrathwing Amplify, Ascension, and Glyphs. This is just not the one. So see you guys. Have a good night.